What's up you guys? In this video, I'm just gonna show you guys, you know, what, you know, I'm getting rid of all like the stuff I cannot fit. So that's what I wanted to show you guys. Like I'm, I just feel real cluttered. Like all my drawers is just full. I need like another set of drawers. I, I had the plastic one, so I didn't really, you know, go all out and get nothing real and serious for this apartment. But, um, as you can see, I do have some plastic. It's just three. I want another set of three because those was pretty full. And I just need some more space. So this video, I just went through all my stuff, all my shirts and everything. Basically, just my tops only for now. Just to, you know, try on some stuff to see if I can fit it or if I can't. Ooh, this lip mask is so good, you guys. I found this off on a whim like after i had got the laneige lip sleeping mask i had found this i think at um maybe marshall's don't get me the lion but if i find it again baby i need it because my lips were so like dry i don't know if it was the weather changing and everything but that brought it right back to life it's so warm out here in cali and I'm already like thinking like when it get really hot outside, it's gonna be crazy. So my video was supposed to be about me cleaning the oven, but I was just so lazy and did not feel like, you know, going to Walmart and getting the stuff. But yeah, I wanted to clean up. I wanted to like declutter my area like right now because I just couldn't wait any longer so I just said why not turn the camera on and show you guys what I'm gonna do so now plus tonight you know I'm be I'm gonna be baking a steak tonight so I have to prep the oven the night before anyway before I even could clean it because the oven spray stuff I believe you gotta spray it and spray it on in the stove the night before or whatever so yeah but and that's what i've been doing is just honestly i've just been chilling and i was like woke up sick one day like before easter i woke up it was friday no it was saturday morning i woke up with a really bad headache you guys and it was just like why what is going on and then it was like, I went to Walmart because I had to get a money order for my rent. And I went there and the machine was down. The money order machine was down and my bank was um, closed on Saturday. I said, why is the bank closed on Saturday anyway? Like, it was good. But it was a bank open to 12, so I had like 30 minutes to hurry up and rush there before they closed. But after the walmart situation i had to rush home because i felt like i was gonna uh puke everywhere i don't know what was going on but i had went back home and took a nap and woke up at like 10 30 and made it to the bank before they closed at 12 so that's what my week is like so i'm really just recovering getting back to my you know normal health right now and during that time, I was just doing some research. I'm really trying to get ready for the summer. So that's why I went through my my uh, tops and like separated what I could fit or what I could keep. So basically, I really didn't get rid of anything. Like I have a bag that I'm going to give to the Goodwill. Let me show you. Just some shoes with no shoestrings, some heels. They're just really like a sad situation to give to Goodwill. So... I mean, the fan, why is it so hot? Oh, you want the fan cookie? I gotta cut off all these lights. It's hot. Okay, you guys, so what I've been doing, you know, I'm getting ready for the summer and everything, and I'm still 
trying to figure out the whole underarm thing. I do not want to be stinky in the summertime. So what I'm doing now has been four days. I've been detoxing my under my underarms. And I've been using the Aztec Healing Clay Mask with the apple cider vinegar. I make a little paste and I put it under my arms and let it sit under my arms for like 15 minutes. And I do that at least once a day. So that's how I'm starting and I'm not using any um, aluminum deodorant. My last deodorant that I was using is this Loom. This is the Loom, the um, Lavender and Sage one. So I've been using that one so far. I got rid of two roll-on band deodorants and I still have the Shore. They're, they both have aluminum but I'm going to just keep those in you know if nothing really changes within the four weeks of this underarm detox i'll have something to go to you know you feel me the shore is unscented so it doesn't have any type of scent at all and the band one that's the powder fresh one and it's a solid stick and i kept the band roll on the powder fresh one because you know i still like it i got rid of the unscented and the regular because it was just a musty scent on it so mm -mm. my throat sounds so bad right now it's crazy but yes i just started detoxing my underarm so why not give the two to four weeks a chance it's been four days already so it's about to be a week already you guys so in the in between like throughout the day if i'm feeling musty or whatever i'm washing my underarms like i'm not going to sit around stinking and the two products, three products that I would use to wash my underarms. This is a fragrance free Dove, the hyper reactive skin balance. This is the body wash. I would use this and I would use the Dove sensitive skin bar soap. And I would use the um, Dow antibacterial soap. I don't know what's up with my throat. It don't want me to be great like, mm -mm. Come on now. Ooh. My hair is freaking oily. Oh my goodness. Oh, I got some dry shampoo from Dove as well. I watched the video because I didn't want to be a test dummy. This guy tried out like 25 dry, dry shampoos for me. So that's why I got that Dove one. Cause he said he liked that one so i gave it a try it smells really good honestly it smells like one of those dove uh spray deodorants but i got rid of those spray deodorants because i really don't like those spray deodorants honestly honestly truly so that's been helping with the oiliness i just got that one like the day before yesterday the dove dry shampoo I forgot how oily your my hair gets when it's straight, you guys. It's still it's still um still silk out. Let me get it together. But yes, I've been doing some research on the detox underarm stuff. And I actually made my own deodorant in this right here. I put it in this one ounce uh amber glass bottle. Gotta have the glass so the recipe called for distilled water, but I had rain water, so I didn't have still water. So I used some rain water. I used five drops of geranium essential oil. Um, I used pink Himalayan sea salt. I used baking soda, and I put some witch hazel in here. Shook it up. Waited to the um, the salts dissolved, baking soda dissolved, and I would spray this on my arms at least, you know, uh, twice a day on clean underarms in the morning. Like, I take showers at night, but in the morning, I will wash my underarms again before I apply that. I do, like, three spritz on each underarm, you guys. And after I made this, like, two days two days uh, later, I had came across this crystal deodorant. I actually wanted the um, actual, like, crystal, but this rolled-on one is pretty much no different than the, the solid crystal one. I read so many good reviews on the crystal deodorant. I never really thought about trying, like, a mineral 
type of deodorant so this is the unscented one it has so many good reviews on it you guys i want to be that person to wear as though i don't smell like nothing like and if i have to detox my underarms to you know go through that get all the aluminum out of my underarms that's what i'm gonna do like i try a lot of stuff so i'm gonna be on a four week no aluminum deodorant and i'm definitely gonna be washing my underarms in between time so yes your girl is really trying to be like odor free using the um aluminum free healthy deodorants you know because i've been using aluminum deodorant all my life and it's just like time for me to say goodbye like it's really like blocking me from sweating and it's just really like the bacteria under my underarm it's, it's not it's not good like i do not like it it stinks and i don't want to stink at all i don't want my clothes smelling musty and strong and stinky and bad mm -mm. so yes so yes what's going to keep me going these four weeks of detoxing my underarms is keeping my underarms clean like i don't care if i have to wash my arms three times a day i'm going to be keeping my arms clean like i don't want to smell must and sweat and bacteria and everything like that i just don't want to smell it so and i'm just going to be using that fragrance free body wash and soap and everything like that because i I don't want to be like out there willy nilly talking about some oh I'm 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 deodorant free. I don't want to smell like that. I want to smell good. I'm not gonna be wearing perfumes and body sprays and clean clothes and smelling like an onion. No. So that's definitely gonna be helping me get through these four weeks by keeping my underarms washed i don't care i'm going to be washing my underarms in the public restroom if i have to and i'm gonna make sure i carry a nice size purse so i could be able to carry the things i need to keep my underarms clean you feel me you guys so yes that's what it is like this summer i want to be smelling fresh i want to be doing less I want to do less I want to smell fresh like and I just want my surroundings to be clear as well so I'm manifesting smelling good underarms I, I'm already feeling like I smell so good from head to toe you guys so that's what it's gonna be and I just wanted to show you guys what I got into today that's just one draw that I that i did today so i still have a whole bin of pants and everything like that that i need to go through and everything so a lot of sweatpants a lot of hoodies so i am definitely a chill girl so sweatpants and hoodies i don't know if i can get rid of those you feel me now it's just bothering me knowing i have a lot of clothes that I just haven't really wore in a while. I just threw this shirt on, so I'm gonna keep this shirt because I could fit it. That's why I'm gonna keep it. I just did some laundry. And yeah, today I just wanna do like a try on, see if I could fit it. I know I gained, you know, just a few pounds and the clothes could still, you know, be kept if I just lose like two or three pounds maybe. But I'm just going to, you know, if I really haven't touched it in like a year and a half, I'm trying to get rid of it. So, I'm going to start with these three drawers I have over here by my bed. So, I just want to show you guys what I'm going to do. And I'm going to bring you guys over there. All my shirts is that in that bottom shelf. So, let's, let's, let's get to it. It's pretty warm out today. Where's my sit? I'm going to be sitting on this step stool. No, sit down. Go back over there and sit. Oh, it's pretty warm out today, you guys, as well. So, so I already have some clothes up here that I took out the drawer. So, we're going to keep going. 
this Chicago shirt. I could keep this because I could fit it. So, and it's pretty lightweight. This Bob Marley shirt, I like it because it's like a vintage type. A vintage type shirt, so I'm gonna keep this. Yeah, this tank top, I'm gonna keep this because I can fit it. A basic white t shirt, I'm gonna keep that because I can fit it. This is a tank top, I know I could still fit this. It's going to be like crop top type. Definitely going to keep that. Cute. I could wear it this summer, spring, whatever. This is another little crop top. This is a small. I could, I could fit this. It's real cute. Got little strings right here i think i'm gonna keep this i really don't want to be you know getting rid of any type of summer clothes my little this is a vintage little t-shirt with the v-neck i'm keeping this because it's a vintage type shirt so i'm gonna keep this i could still fit it that's why I mean, this dazed and confused. This is like a car t-shirt, so I like it. You know, Cali and Cali on the weekends, they bring out all the old school cars and everything. And I love some old school cars, you guys. I do, I do. So I think I'm going to keep this one as well. I haven't worn it that much, but I'm definitely going to wear it this summer okay now this is really really cute but i don't know if i could fit it so i'm gonna, let me try this on real quick to see what it's given let me see cute little um v-neck zipper shirt let me try this on just to see if i could fit it see you got to understand i'm in cali so Short shorts is cool. I mean, I could wear it. Like, I could still wear this, honestly. It's a short crop shirt. It has the zipper so I could zip it down. Some more is super cute to me. It has a collar, so let me see what the collar looks like all the way down like i love little cute shirts like this and i don't think i really wore this shirt that much so you could zipping it down this is zipping off pull it down it's really i think i'm gonna keep this because this is like my style you guys I really like these type of tops and I had got this top when my stomach was a little bit more bigger and I said I'm gonna wait till it get more slim see look at it it's getting more small in my stomach and that's how it look and I think I'm gonna keep this I think I'm gonna keep it y'all it's so cute to me gray i like it it's just like a i could wear it you know hot day some shorts some really cute shorts and i'm good to go so that's what it look like yes Purr. that's what it look like it's just like cover my boobs it's a halter top it's like a ribbed material so i do like it because it's unique you guys it's very unique okay let's find s something else it's gonna be so hard for me to get rid of stuff because i ain't that old you know 
and with my body i'm not giving up on my body that's why i'm doing exercising and i'm really like incorporating more fruits and salads in my diet right now just because the summer is here in cali for real it's like in the 70s 80s right now so i do want to you know look cute so i'm gonna keep this where's my keep palette oh, right here on to the next one this is like a setting material shirt it's like plaid type let me see it's, it's inside out but it's it's really unique it's like a burnt orange and white cream white shirt and it has like the little what do you call it like the uh, inside out so type design honestly a see-through and you can wear it with like a cute black bra under it so i think i'm gonna keep this maybe let me let me try let me try it on because you probably can't really understand what it is but that's what it looked like up front so let's see what it looked like on okay this is a see-through top so that's what it looked like you guys on is like a fitted super comfortable type top that's what the sleeves look like it has a little fur fruit sleeves super cute that's what the neck look like the neck is just like fitted neck it fits really good and this top is also could be cute with some cute little jean shorts and stuff like that so that's why I'm gonna keep it. It's soft, breathable, it's see-through, so it'll be good for the summer as well. So I'm gonna keep this top I can wear with a nice cute black bra under it, some cute jean shorts, and that's just what it looked like. That's what it looked like in the, from the back. I'ma just put this robe top on because it's going to be easy for me to keep, you know, trying on stuff. So I'm going to just deal with the robe instead of putting on a shirt. Shirt I had on. Okay, hair in my mouth. I hate it. This shirt, I think I, I actually just got this shirt. It's really like a nice basic fitted t-shirt. I haven't worn it yet. It says collective soul dosage and it's like a lady and it has bees around her mouth. It's like a candy man t-shirt, but it's really cute. I like the gray. Okay, hold on. But like I said before my camera cut off, just like a really cute shirt. I like the colors to it. It's like a gray with the orange, the blue, and it has bees on it. So I thought it was cool shirt and it's like one of those shirts that's like you know cinch at the waist a little bit so it's really cute I could wear this um and I like her, eye, her eyelashes on it her eyelashes look really cute so this would be a nice little shirt if I don't want to show like my belly button or anything like that. This is a long sleeve shirt. Like my little vintage shirts like this. I like to keep them all honestly because they're just like super cool honestly. And I can wear them with like leggings and it has a little wording on the sleeve and stuff like that. So this is the ACDC shirt. Hey, I be headbanging sometimes. So I'm gonna keep that. Okay, this is, I wore this shirt like one time. It's a really cute, like petite, breathable long sleeve shirt. It has like the design like that last one, the burnt orange one has like the inside out stitching on it. And this is like a cream and black long sleeve super cute petite shirt let me try this on because i i like the style but let's see if it look good on me 
I don't know what the bra on camera better. See, that's the bra. I actually just got this bra because I needed some type of bra like this. Strapless all black bra. Okay. So let's try on this shirt. I was not expecting to do a try on haul. But these clothes, I'm not really trying to be like or quarter for stuff that I don't wear. So. And I like tight fitted like cute tops and stuff like that. So let's see if this is worth keeping. That's what the bottom look. I might have to, you know, adjust how the shoulder and arm fit. Just because it's like one of those tight fitted shirts. So. Let me play with the sleeves real quick. The kind of long sleeve. You feel me? But that's what the shirt looks like. Let me, my bra suck. I think my bra's too small. So this shirt is really cute, honestly. That's what it look like. Has the long since sleeves you could wear it like that it's honestly not that bad let me see it's not that bad so i'm keep this one is this bag right there but it has numbers like eight eight four thirty six us uk but i think this is like a um Maybe an H&M top or Forever 21, I'm not sure. Another cute little vintage t-shirt that I love. These little cinched at the waist type t-shirts. So I'm definitely going to keep this. I know I could fit it. So I'm going to keep this one. This is a, just a regular little t-shirt. I got this from Walmart out the freaking kids section because I thought the back looked it so cool. So I'm definitely going to keep this because it's just one of those kid friendly type t-shirts. I'm keeping everything so far. I really thought, you know, it was going to be bad. I'm keeping this. This is like a basic you know, um, like a Skims inspired type bodysuit. This is just a gray one. It has like a slight padded inside, but it don't have pads. It just has like a little, little uh, extra piece of fabric in the front. So I'm definitely gonna keep this basic. You can wear it with some jean shorts and stuff like that, basic top i have that in gray another little basic scams type tank top this tank top one side is a v-neck and the other side is like a, a crew neck i guess is it crew? but yes basic tank top keeping it gotta keep the basics you guys this is the, it's very like small so let me try this on and see if I like it. I think it's an off the shoulder type shirt. So that's how it look. The sleeves is pretty long so you can wear it like that. That's what it look like. Let me see. That's what it look like. What it look like from the back. I don't know if I want to keep this. I really don't. But I like how it look. You will really pair this with some cute jean shorts. I think I have a pair of cute jean shorts. Probably like one or two pair. That fits me really nice. But that's how it look. What y'all think? Should I keep this or not? I'm going to leave this around to see what y'all say in the comments but it is pretty warm it's like a warm type of 
material. I don't know if you can see it. It's like a towel washcloth type material. Mm -hmm. Oh no. I'm I'm gonna put this to the side, see what y'all say. This one this is an all white shirt with the like the roses going down the sleeve. Can y'all see it? Roses down going down the sleeve, rose on the front, and it says hustle under it. You know, this is like just you know a throw on type shirt for the summer. Cool breezy type shirt shorts leggings whatever two <laughs> is anybody allergies acting up okay this what that shirt is looking like cute little breezy little top you could wear with some shorts you know So I'm gonna keep this one just because you know you don't, you don't want to be feeling naked all the time, do you? You want to at least have some decent, real, fully clothed clothing that look cute. So I'm gonna keep this one. The brand is called Locked, Locked and Loaded. Locked and Loaded. Locked and Loaded. But I do like that it said hustle on the front because I am a hustler. I'm a hustler. I'm, I'm a hustler, homie. X about me. Okay. Alright. I'm keeping this another basic top. I got this from Target. It has the, um, the zipper. It's the body suit zipper. Short. Like the sleeve is, you know like that has the zipper you could show some cleavage with this or you could zip it all the way up and not have any cleavage so I'm gonna keep that this is another little bodysuit I honestly don't wear this that much it's like a olive green khaki green type uh, bodysuit something like you know kid friendly if I was a mom friendly uh, bodysuit with some jean shorts, nice and cool and breezy for the summer. So I'll keep this because I know I can fit it. I'm not even going to try it on. Okay. This is, every time I see this tank top, I got it. It's really like a colorful type jamming, 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 jamming type tank top. It reminds me of the freaking Child's Play Chucky. But I still think it's so cute, you guys. And I could wear it just like nice with some all white little pants. Like, I have some sheer pants that's like for my swimsuit. So, this would be cool to even just wear over like a swimsuit. So I really haven't gotten to wear this that much. And I think I'm going to keep it. I think I'm going to keep it because I go fit it. It's like a cute little basic tank top. You can wear it. How I feel about these clothes. I'm going to make sure I wear these clothes this summer and then next summer. I'll restock and really get rid of these clothes because... Just to have some new inventory. This basic tank top, it has like a padded bra inside. Gotta keep the basic tank top. So this is the black one. I think I got this one from Target. So I'm keeping that one. Ooh, that camera be cut off. Okay, I had this for a while. It's a very pretty bronzy glitter type tank top. 
and it actually would be really cute with some jeans let me try it on jeans shorts and i always always like this tank top i just haven't worn it that much i don't think maybe one time or two times but i'm definitely going to wear it this summer that's what it looked like my bra is too small i gotta go get another new bra let me fix my bra because it's making my titties look flat so that's what it looked like it's like a bronzy tan pink color and that's what it looked like from the back Let me see. That's what it looked like from the back. So I'm gonna keep it. It's like a sexy top to me. It's glittery. You probably can't really see it on camera like that, but it's like a bronze glitter to it. Love it, love it, love it. This is a basic brown tank top. Really soft rib tank top. Let me see if I can fit it. Um, line. And you can wear like the a really cute, nice bra. I got to get a bigger bra. And then you can show a little cleavage up there. It's super comfortable. I'm definitely keeping this. Keeping these army type shorts. These are pajama shorts. I got these from Target. Come on now, Target is where I get my clothes from. What? <laughs> I'm just gonna have a lot of giveaway stuff. From the looks of it, I don't. Oh my goodness. This is a freaking turtleneck. Why do I have so many clothes with the like inside out stitching? You see this? I mean, it's brand new too. I'm going to need this white tank top for something one day. So I'm keeping this. It's a lingerie type bra. I'm black. I'm going to have to keep this. Bye. I'm going to have to keep this because it's a basic bra bodysuit. Okay. So I found a couple cute little summer tops. I'm going to try this on. But let me show you this. Right. I had a few people. I didn't know what they was turning and looking at. Right. This is um, this is a short set. It's ribbed. Ribbed um, shorts. What is that? There you go. But look, it's a shorts, like, bodysuit outfit, right? I wore this last summer, right? And I was out, you know, minding my business, shopping or whatever. And I was getting a lot of looks, a lot of head turning. And by the end of the day, I was on a laundromat. And this man looked twice. He was like, oh, my God, I thought you ain't had no clothes on. Wow. I don't know what to do with this. It's really cute and everything. But I don't know if I want it. If I want to keep it. Let me try it on and show you guys what it look like. And it's like my freaking skin color too. I didn't really pay no attention to that. It has the little black zipper. That's the only thing. But it's so comfortable. That's the only thing, like, why should I have to give away something that's comfortable? <laughs> Look, I gotta pull it up because you don't want no crazy sculptedness on you. So that's what it look like, right? Ain't it my skin color? Look. My bra suck. This bra suck. But that's what it looked like. I don't know if y'all can really see the color. Let me bring you. 
That's what it look like. I right, hope we get with my little Balenciaga hat. I mean, gap hat. We do like that big Balenciaga. I go wear it with this. But if it's, you know, looking like I don't got no clothes on, I don't mean, So I think I might get this away, honestly. I'm gonna look, I want this in all black. If I can find this in all black, I'm definitely going to be rocking it. Friend, if anybody's wondering what the tag look like, LA Lux on the brand, the tag. Excuse my nails, I still have not gotten to putting on my nails, and I think I'm gonna do that today. Because, yes. Okay, let me try on this cute little. It say good things. Good things ahead. And that's what it look like. It's a cute little shirt with the V at the bottom. And in the back it's like open back. And you could tie it. Good vibes ahead. And that's what it look like in the back. Let me take the back is like open back so I probably wouldn't even wear a bra at all with it because I don't like I don't like how it look I wore this shirt one time and I love it I love it so love the one cute little hippie top that's what it look like in the front that's what it look like in the back it has like a lower backing so let me try it so so like it's a cute top wear with some shorts that's what it look like it's like a bunchy side that's what it look like in the back a lot of backage you get a lot of backage showing so Love one. It has the little mushroom plant on top. I like it. It's really cute, you guys. It's really, really cute. So I'm gonna keep this one. This is a um, Jimi Hendrix type top. Cute. That's what it look like. It's like a vintage type top. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna keep this so it didn't look like I had much to really give away you guys but I wanted to try on some stuff and show you guys what I was doing and show you guys me doing it in the process so summer ready I got some summer clothes already so and whatever i can't fit going to the goodwill thank you guys for watching this video see you on the next one holla jimmy